home. Or, sorry, I just got to New York. My mother's <clears throat> home is far away from here now. Uh, <clears throat> but I had some packages waiting for me here. Open up my first one. monthly order from my comic shop but the order gets put in months before they send it so I don't ever remember what I ordered this looks like a much smaller order than normal this must have been a month where I decided to cut back a little bit <clears throat> Let's see what we got Batman killing time number two I did read the first one of that. It was was decent. Got spun. 328. One of my ongoings. I will not stop. Batman Beyond White Knight. That is a book one. So can't wait to dive into that. <coughs> uh, now we're talking. A Town Called Terror. Image number one. I'm going to read that today before our podcast. Try to get those two books in. Midnight Rose. Aftershock. I always like Aftershock. And my ongoing Batman, of course. Have to have. Good deal. We got a black label here. Obviously, Heavy DC, Image, and Aftershock seems to be my thing. One Dark Night, book two. So, I did not read book one, I don't believe. <clears throat> I'm going to have to double check that. But... So, I'm going to hold off on that one for now. Try to get some of these number ones in before the podcast tonight. Good morning. It is Tuesday, April 26th. I am in Dixon City, Pennsylvania. It is my last day here. Tomorrow I get to go back to Palm Bay. Looking forward to that. Got a little trick-or-treat I'm wearing this morning. First day without a wrestling shirt. I have plenty to choose from in my bag, but I love me some horror. So yeah, we're going to go hit the gym, do a little back. And uh, let's get this day started, baby. Insatiable hunger for one another. They want to feed on your limbs, torn asunder. A taste for your flesh, their primal excess. They become one.
morning it is thursday april 28th i am back in palm bay florida for a couple days uh actually i leave again tomorrow morning first thing in the morning uh, about to hit the planet fitness it's about six o'clock in the morning so yeah uh got a lot of organizing of figs and my office today so looking forward to that finally getting that all set up it's been a long time coming so yeah let's get this day started baby doing guys it's me reacting about it again with my small segment of binge watching all the wrestlemanias i just finished wrestlemania 2 and it was a lot better than the first one i'm not gonna lie um i would say favorite match will be um Haas and terry funk versus i actually forgot who were the rivals <laughs> i kind of woke just woke up and i forgot to do this video and I'm starting to watch WrestleMania 3. And I would say Hulk Hogan versus King Kong Bundy for the FW, uh, not the FWF. <laughs> the WWF world title was a pretty good match. And the whole event, I will give them a 6. I would say it was a pretty good event. And for the worst match, I would say... I... Uh, I can actually say there was a good match, actually. Yeah, it was a pretty good event. I would say it was a pretty good event. My favorite match, I would say, is um, the Macho Man versus uh, George the Animal Steel, for sure. So that will be my take for today. I'm going to start watching WrestleMania 3. And you guys take care and wave your hair. Waiting for the dream. That's right, buddy. No Carolina. Newborn. Newborn. What's up, folks? We have Tingo Mori here on Cinco de Mayo for the Hey Buddy Network. See that? I remember the date. I hope you're doing all right. I hope you're doing good. I'm exhausted, but I'm feeling great, to be honest, after a lot of 
nonsense you guys don't really want to know i hope you guys are doing great i hope your uh ficons are being awesome with a lot of chase no swappies and i'm feeling great overall to be honest i've been feeling frustrated and honestly this uh this will be like the second day in a row that i go to the gym after a long time i'm feeling great and i hope you guys do too so take care and wave your hair Of course. doing guys yeah i think i'm already here getting out of the gym finally able to finish wrestlemania 3 it was a lot better than the other two uh favorite match it's hard to it's hard to pick between um honky tonk man versus randy set i mean not randy uh, uh jake the snake robbers randy randy savage versus uh ricky steamboat was also good Surprisingly, Hogan and the song is in my eyes. Hogan versus um, Andre the Giant was better than I expected. So I would say those are my top three matches with no bad match, I would say. And I'll give the event, I'll say an eight. I'll give it an eight out of ten. Best one so far. <laughs>